Hello, my name is Ash. I'm a Dell storage engineer, and I'm going to be talking about Dell PowerVault tape solutions today, specifically external tape, how it connects to the SAS host buffs adapters that Dell sells and offers, as well as cable compatibility, how you connect the host bus adapters that we offer up to the external tape solutions. Dell currently uh, sells and supports two uh, external tape SAS bus adapters. Uh, the first is the Dell SAS 5E HBA. Uh, as I said, it does support external tape. Uh, it is PCI Express 1.0. It is a 3 gigabit per second adapter. And most importantly, uh, to distinguish this adapter from the other, uh, is it has two InfiniBand connectors. You'll see the one I've circled in red. Um, if you take a look at this adapters and you compare it to what I will show you with the other Dell uh, SAS HBA, this adapter is a little bit wider and thicker. Um, that's important to note so when you're purchasing cables to connect to your external tape drive, um, you take note of the type of connector this is. This is an InfiniBand connector. So as I mentioned, uh, Dell SAS 5E HBA has an InfiniBand connector circled in red. However, the Dell PowerVault tape drive uh, has a different type of connector. You'll notice that this is a little bit skinnier. You may not be able to tell exactly from the picture but um, it is not protruding as much as, as obviously the Dell SAS 5E um, InfiniBand connector. Uh, on the back of your PowerVault tape drive, you'll see uh, either two of these mini SAS connectors or uh, one of them, depending on the hardware revision of your tape drive. Um, and the cable you're going to want to look for uh, to purchase with your uh, Dell SAS 5E and connecting it to your Dell PowerVault tape drive is a InfiniBand and MiniSAS cable. So when you talk to your Dell sales representative, you're going to mention that you're going to want a InfiniBand and MiniSAS cable. Uh, you can see on the left of the cable in the picture, the connection is a InfiniBand connector which connects to your Dell SAS 5E. And on the right side is a MiniSAS connector. It's a little bit skinnier and, and it goes into the uh, Dell PowerVault external tape drive. The second uh, SAS host bus adapter that Dell sells is uh, the newer Dell SAS 6 gigabit per second HBA. Again, this supports external tape. It is PCI Express 2.0 and it is 6 gigabit per second SAS. Uh, the difference here is, is really uh, they should be concerned about is the mini SAS connectors on the back. Uh, there's two mini SAS connectors instead of two InfiniBand connectors like the SAS 5E. Um, you'll see those circled in red. Uh, the mini SAS connectors, as I, as I mentioned before, are a little bit skinnier and obviously take a different type of cable and that's what's important here. When you're connecting this to your tape drive, you're not going to want to use the same cable that you use for the SAS 5E. You're going to want to use a, the SAS, a different cable for the SAS 6 gigabit HBA. As I mentioned before, there's a mini SAS connector on the SAS 6 gigabit HBA. And um, using the Dell PowerVault tape drive, there's also a mini SAS connector on there. So the correct cable you're going to want to use is a mini SAS to mini SAS cable. Uh, the mini SAS mini SAS connect cable will only connect these two devices and won't connect the SAS 5E to the, the Dell PowerVault tape drive. It's very important when you're talking to your Dell sales representative that you uh, effectively describe what you're connecting uh, the tape drive to because the tape drive, Dell PowerVault tape drive will always have a mini SAS connector, either one or two on the back. Um, but depending on what kind of HBA you have in your server, whether it has an InfiniBand connector or a mini SAS connector, that will determine uh, the type of cable you will want to uh, purchase. Um, also note both of these cables, the mini SAS, the mini SAS, and the uh, InfiniBand and mini SAS are supported in one meter, two meter, and four meter varieties. Uh, I hope this has been helpful uh, in clearing up um, and allowing you to determine what cables you want to purchase uh, with your HBAs. And thank you for watching.